Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 4. Today we're going to be talking about some potential sort of rumours that have been circling around on the internet, so we're going to be talking about it and breaking it down. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so this is... A massive rumor I have no idea if it's true or not but we're going to be going over it nevertheless because it's been circulating around people have been asking and I'm sort of in two minds right now so this guy who is an actor apparently and he's playing a character that he officially called Mon zor -El. and so this is coming from Trey Sartorius and in his Instagram post, he says, I can't wait for everyone to meet Mon zor -El. Thank you, Supergirl CW, for giving me this amazing role alongside the legend, Melissa Benoist. So, we have no idea if this is true. And on one hand, I think the CW would never let him reveal anything this big that, you know, he's, say, the cousin of Kara at, or the cousin of Kal-El because... The CW wouldn't let someone, and this person I have to say, he's a non-actor, so he's gone in, he's definitely done an interview for this character that he supposedly calls Mon zor -El. so I think you have to take it with a huge grain of salt that this could be totally not true. I, I do definitely believe he was on set, he was walking around, he was doing a video, 100% 100 believe he was on set, but he could be just auditioning for any role and we know they weren't actually shooting on this day I believe they were actually outside doing some shoots with the main cast so it seems like maybe he went in for an interview he did this and then he posted this on Instagram and yeah I, we have no idea we haven't heard of a character called Mon zor -El, and he supposedly confirms in air quotes I'm doing this because again we have no idea if it's true or false that he is going to be the cousin of Kara zor -El, and that is where I come in and say this makes no sense because number one Superman and Kara in the comics don't have another cousin and why would another Kryptonian just pop out of nowhere be like yo Kara I'm your cousin that just doesn't really make any sense in my mind because you know there would have been build up there's no build up and maybe he appears in the finale but I, I have this feeling that he's not actually going to be playing Mon zor -El. Maybe it's a temporary name because we know in the crossover they were casting for a character called lon L, And that turned out to be a completely different character. So I think it could be along those lines. And he is wearing his sort of suit a bit like what? mon -El wore when he worked at Catco. So a bit like Mike Matthews. So definitely he's been on set and everything. But I don't know. I don't think the CW would let him do this and on his Instagram he's been posting a load of stories and everything being like oh, I'm so grateful for this time I can't wait to show you all the character and so on and so forth so it could number one be a publicity thing or it could be a hundred percent true or you know he's just playing a different character not called Mon zor -El, and maybe this is just misleading but he did actually say that he had to delete the post and in the new post it says I can't wait for everyone to meet Mon in brackets and then thank you for the Supergirl CW so he took out the zor -El at the end but he initially posted it with zor -El and people sent it to me so thank you to all of you who sent it so I'm of two minds I I don't think he's going to be Mon zor -El. I don't think he's going to be a very big character but I could be totally wrong that's just what pops into my head straight away because it just makes no sense why would you just like bring in another zor -El when we know nothing about this we've never seen it in the comics there's been no build up on the TV show yeah I don't know but anyway let's talk about the name though Mon zor -El. that's proper rubbing it in isn't it that's like the CW, if they actually come out with a character called Mon zor -El, that's like a big F you to the face, like a massive middle finger, because, you know, mon -El left last season, he has the potential to come back, and if he comes back, and there's another character called Mon zor -El, you know, very similar, but he's got the zor -El surname, like Kara zor -El, so, you know, the cousin or brother or something of her, but... I'm pretty sure she would have mentioned it if she knew she had 
a family member called Monzorel that was ridiculously similar to Monel in name. I'm pretty sure she would have been surprised when maybe Monel revealed his name and was like, yo, my name's Monel, I'm from Daxum. And then she might be like, oh, I had a cousin called Monzorel. So that's another thing. Don't really buy that, but I just think it's a massive F you to the face if this is true. And I know tons of you guys who were messaging me were like, hmm, this is a massive WTF, like, if this is actually true, this is some April Fool shit right here. So, I love the comments you guys were sending in on Twitter, and, you know, there are so many questions as to who this is. I guess it could be potentially, like, Zorel had a son that Kara never knew about, maybe, like, a half-brother to Kara or something like that. But, I don't know if it seems for real, and it does show that he's on set, so he's definitely playing a character, but I don't know. I just don't really buy it. Let me know in the comments down below if you do buy it. Also, just to mention, he is mixed race, so is he, like, the future son of, like, Kara and James Olsen? I know that's, like, way in the past. But that potentially could be happening. Maybe he's back from the future or something. Maybe he's a time traveler. I don't know. But he's definitely not, you know, Monel and Kara's daughter. Because, you know, they would be white. Because Chris and Melissa are white. So, I don't know. That's also a bit confusing as to how they're going to do that. Maybe it's, like I mentioned, zor actually. Who had another son that we have no idea about. But we're just going to quickly go over some of his comments. So... In that new post where he says, I can't wait for everyone to meet Mon, uh, he actually was asked by a fan, wait a minute, Superman is her cousin. I've never heard of Mon Are you appearing in the final of season four? And then he replies, I can't say too much, but it's a character that they're making. It's not known in the comic books, and the writers made this character up for just for the series. So, again... He's been way too open. That's one reason why I don't really buy it too much because the CW would not let something as big as this actually get revealed. And the fact that he's saying, oh, the writers just made up this character. I, I do believe that, you know, they could potentially do that. They make up a lot of characters and they change a lot of things. So, you know, Monzoro could exist that they just randomly plant in at the end of the season. But the fact that he says, I can't say too much, but they made it up, just for the series. It's just way, way too in your face being like, yeah, I'm explaining way too much, and I think he's explaining too much, but we know that the public isn't allowed to actually have set visits on the set, so he's definitely on the set as an actor, he's in this suit and everything, but I don't know, I really, really don't buy it, and it, like I said earlier, I think the fact that Monel is going to wait, and if they bring in a character called Monzorel, that's just a massive middle finger. But it could potentially be like the cliffhanger for season four. But yeah, I don't buy it that he's being too open about it. And I think the fandom would totally revolt against this new character. And I think it's a really bad idea if it is actually true that this is Kara's cousin that we have no idea about and it just happens to be so that he's called Mon Zorel, so similar to Monel and there's so many Monel fans out there including myself that when I saw this I was like huh I just had to double check a few times because it just seems like if this is true wow <laughs> way too soon guys way too soon so let me know in the comments down below what do you think about all this? I just think if it is true, it's just way, way too soon to have a character called Mon Zorel, like, come into Kara's life and actually just change things like that. And I guess it could be the cliffhanger, but I don't know. So let me know all your opinions. Leave a like and a comment. Also, subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at the DC TV show to stay up to date with me. That's where I actually talked about this information. Tons of you guys, like I mentioned in this video, actually came with your opinion. So that was a big sort of help for this video when I was looking at the main overall reaction, which was actually very much so in line with mine. So that was very nice to see that I wasn't the only one freaking out. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.